Hello ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and everyone in between. Welcome back to another lesson here at howtoplaythesax.com. My name is Matthew, and today I thought we'd get some Beatles happening. Beatles, well, shake it up baby now. Twist and shout. Twist and shout by the Beatles. Beatles, obviously. Who has not heard of the Beatles? The Beatles are obviously a legendary band. They started everything. We are still here now because of the Beatles. How awesome are the Beatles? Hands up, who likes the Beatles? Excellent, hands up, who doesn't like the Beatles? Right, you people, please. You're wrong. You do like the Beatles, you just don't quite know it yet. So, Twist and Shout by the Beatles. The good thing about Twist and Shout by the Beatles is that it's kind of one of those songs as a call and response. So, you know, the band does one thing and then we can do a similar thing. So call and response. So for those of you who sadly don't know Twist and Shout, I will take it upon myself to educate you because you have to know a lot of Beatles songs. Twist and Shout. So. The band, the singer, sings, Well, shake it up, baby, now! And then we, as saxophonists, we can do the backing vocals. So the backing vocals are, Shake it up, baby! Then the band, Twist and shout! And then we go, Twist and shout! So we're going to follow along with the backing vocals first of all. Then we'll move into actually playing along with the verse. But right for now, this second, Let's concentrate on the backing vocals. How do the backing vocals go? Very easy. Well, shake it up, baby, now. And we go on our saxophones. G sharp, G sharp, G sharp, B flat. So we got G sharp, G sharp, G sharp, B flat. Can you try? G sharp, G sharp, B flat. One more time. So we got G sharp, G sharp, G sharp, B flat, B flat, da 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 da. Cool, let's try that together. One, two, three, four. I'll kind of sing. Well, shake it up, baby, now. Twist and shout. Come on, come on, come on, baby, now. Let's work it all out. Uh. So it kind of does that over and over again. Fairly simple, fairly simple so far. Can we mix it up a little bit? Can we mix it up a bit? Yes, we can. Instead of going G sharp, G sharp, G sharp, B flat, B flat, can we instead mix it up a bit? Can we go B, 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 C sharp? B, 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 C sharp, C sharp. So we've got the same rhythm da, 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 before we were going da, 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 da. now let's try da, 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 da. can we do that again i'll speak through it we'll do our b's and c sharps yeah okay we'll try that starting on a b this time well shake it up baby now twist and shout. Come on, come on, come on, baby, now. Let's work it on out. Uh. Yeah, cool. So before we did G sharp, G sharp, G sharp, B flat, B flat. Now we're doing. Can we? Yes, we can is the answer, but can we throw it in another mix up? Can we mix it up again? Instead of G sharp, starting with the G sharps, instead of starting with a B, can we start with an E? E with a register key. So we got one, two, three, one, two, register key, E. E, 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 F sharp, F sharp, E, 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 F sharp, F sharp. Same again, let's try that. Notes along the bottom. One, two, well shake it up baby now. <laughs> Twist and shout. <laughs> you know this song, G sharps. Here we go. 
Well, shake it up, baby. Cool. How'd you go with that one? Let's do that again. So we'll do the first verse with G sharps, G sharp, G sharp, B flat, B flat. Second verse, let's live on the edge here and let's go from B, 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 C sharp, C sharp. Yeah, so first verse, G sharps and B flats. Second verse, B's and C sharps. Let's give it a go again. Now we'll go B's and C sharps. <laughs> All right, you're getting the hang of it. This is good. Now, next time, let's do it again. We'll do G sharps first, like we just did. Then we'll do Bs, like we just did. There's a third verse. We'll go to our E's. Yeah, E's and F sharps. Let's give it a go again. Now we'll go E. All right, fantastic, fantastic. Now, the next bit in this song, this is good, this is good. Welcome to the Beatles, fantastic. The next bit, iconic bit in the song, there's a whole heap of ahs, and you know it, you've heard this in a million songs, it originated from this one. I'm pointing to the iPad just here, okay? It wasn't my iPad that it originated from, from. Shut up, Matthew, just keep going. Okay, so we got the ah, 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 and then there's a bit of screaming, wow, well, shake it up, baby, now. And then it goes back into the back into the verses. Cool. So those R's, we're coming up to the R's. The R's start on a low F sharp. F sharp, no register key. F sharp, middle finger. And then it goes to a B flat. And then it goes to a C sharp. And then it goes to an E. Yeah? Cool. Excellent. This is good. Fantastic. All right. There's the backing vocals on Twist and Shout. Quickly, just quickly, let's see if we can do the verses as well, because it's very, very simple. Well, shake it up, baby, now. It sounds like... What are those notes? Download the cheat sheet. The cheat sheet, the cheat sheet. I love the cheat sheets. Hopefully you love the cheat sheets too. Cheap cheat sheets. It's really hard to say when you've got a mouthful of saxophone. All right, can you guys, let's do the whole song. Let's play the verses and the backing vocals. The verses and the backing vocals. So just have a quick listen. This is what it's going to sound like. Ready? <laughs> Let's give it a go. If you mess it up, that's cool. Maybe stick to just the verse and let the band do the backing vocals. Maybe just stick to the backing vocals and let the band do the verse. Either way, I challenge you to be able to play both. Play both the main vocal and the backing vocal. That is my challenge to you. Let's do that now, but like I say, if you get stuck, if it's a bit of a challenge, stick with one or the other. Stick with the backing vocals or stick with the, the lead vocals, either or. You do you, have fun, play saxophone, be awesome, repeat, but I challenge you to do both. But it's no stress if you can't, or you won't, or you don't, or you just wanna go and have a cup of tea somewhere, or a cup of coffee, or a beer, or a can of Coke, or whatever, a glass of water whatever. You do you, but let's try 
the whole thing. We'll see how we go. And if we mess it up, hey, what's it matter? You ready? Here we go. All right. Ready? Verses this time. <laughs> Well done. That's enough from me. That's a bit of a mouthful. That is a challenge, what we've just done there. Doing both, playing the verse, sorry, playing the lead vocals and playing the backing vocals. That is a challenge. But you guys are up to it. And if you don't or won't or can't or don't, not feeling it, that's cool. No problem. Do one or the other. And then, and then swap. Do the other and then one. Up to you. My name's Matthew. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much for visiting me here today at howtoplaythesax.com. Here inside the members area, there's heaps more coming. Let me know if you've got any particular song requests. But anyway, that's enough from me. Well done. Twist and Shout by The Beatles. Iconic song. Thank you, and I'll see you in another lesson at another time at howtoplaythesax.com. Thanks. Boop <laughs> boop